Hi, I'm Minister Sherry Gallagher with IGBN, and this is my lovely host with me, Nona Thomas, prophetess Nona Thomas. And you know what I'm going to say to that? That this is the day that the Lord has made, and we will rejoice, and we're glad in it, aren't we? Yes, we are. We, we are. definitely, definitely are. Well, we want to welcome you to our weekly broadcast with IGBN News Live, where we discuss what's going on here at iGospel Broadcasting Network. We also talk about what's going on in our local community and the current events around the world. Well, you already gave the scripture for today, (laughs) but we do want to encourage you, our audience, we want to encourage you wherever you are to remember that whatever news you're dealing with, whatever situations you may be dealing with as Christians, we build our lives on the good news. That's what Jesus has done in our lives, what he's doing in our lives and what we're expecting him to do in our lives. Amen. Amen. Well, Father God, we just ask you today to be with us, to be with our audience. You know more than we could ever know what they're going through, what they need in their lives and their local communities and and, uh, what they're hoping and believing for. And we ask that you would be with them, that you would touch their lives, heal their bodies, that you would move in their financial situations and their family situations, that you would do a work, the work that you've been doing from the beginning and that you would continue to do till the end. And we just received that today, right now, in Jesus' mighty name. Amen. Amen, amen. (laughs) Well, Nona, for those who may be with us for the very first time, would you tell them a little bit about IGBN? I would love to do that. I want to first share with you our vision here at iGospel Broadcasting Network. It's to provide low or no-cost avenues of advertising for ministries and churches to expand the good news of Jesus Christ all around the world. Isn't that great? Let me tell you how we're going to do it. We're going to do it by hosting various outreach events. You know, we have to go out. You know, it's not about four walls and Christian performances, family recreational activities, and providing tools and technology for the expansion of the kingdom of God. And that's just a little bit. There's so much more than that because we're growing leaps and bounds, yes, aren't we? Yes, we are. Yes, in fact, we got another divine connection today we're looking forward to. I'll just give you a little preview. There was an anointed man of God from Africa. Now, this man of God has raised the dead. He's moved in the prophetic. He's moved in the healing and anointings, and he's going to be working with us and doing some some stuff here at IGBN. So we're not going to tell you everything that's coming with him, but there's always something new. God is always doing something new here at IGBN. Amen. Amen. Because what he's doing, he's expanding our borders. We're we're international. We were already international. He's even expanding the borders, you know, right now. I want to say that God is ex- expanding. He's broadening your territory right now in Jesus' name. Receive that word. Amen. Praise God. Now, that's what happens when you have a prophet at the table. Amen. <laughs> <laughs> Praise God. <laughs> well, I want to tell you about some of our upcoming events. Don't you want to know what we're doing here at IGBN? Well, I want to tell you about our very next event, which is, uh, well, it's not our very next event because we have a lot of stuff happening here, but it's the IGBN monthly prophetic overflow service. Amen. Ooh. Amen. This is a vision that God's given to the prophet and, um, The Bible says that there are some things you'll never, ever get in your life unless a prophet, unless it comes from the word of a prophet. So you want to be here during those services. Now, that's going to be coming up Saturday, May 7th. That's coming up very soon. So you want to mark your calendars and be here. Um, Well, well, actually, actually it's May 21st. May 21st. Well, what's May 7th? Well, May 7th, look, we got to tell you, May 7th is our Grill to Glory program. Oh, that's right. No, no, correct me, correct me. That's all right, (laughs) because there's so much going on in our GDN. Yes, yes. Uh, Sunday, May 15th at 5 p.m., we're going to do our very first worship night. Um, We're just giving God the glory. This is something that God put on my heart. Um, We were doing jam sessions, Mm -hmm. which was a mix of, you know, Christian and some uh, family friendly songs. Mm -hmm. Right, right. And um, but God said, I want a night just for me. 
I just want you to worship and, and give me praise. The Bible says when the praises go up, the blessings come down. Well, that's a principle, not an actual scripture for those of you who are <laughs> sticklers about that. But, um, <laughs> but we're going to have our very first, and who knows, there may be more coming, but this one may be the only one. So show up. <laughs> that's going to be Sunday, May 15th at 5 at 5 uh, 5 p.m. here at IGBN, and we're just going to be here for his glory. That's what it's called, for his glory worship night, praise and worship night. Hallelujah, and it's totally free. So come on out to just praise and worship to give him glory. I don't think there's a bad time to do that. All time, all there should continually be praises out of our mouth. Exactly. Don't you agree? Amen. I Amen. wish we could have a worship night every night. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. And we can, really, and on we, the inside. We really and can. we can. And we can. And we can. Um, but as a reminder, since I said it out of place earlier, we do have the prophetic overflow service. Why yes. don't you tell us about that? And so that is something that the Lord has uh, given me and we had truly a good time mm-hmm. the prophetic overflow amen and so it's every right now it's every third saturday at 3 p.m okay and so come on out 13754 shoreline drive earth city missouri 63045 the holy ghost always shows up he's always here in fact he's waiting for you and he may because he's always here at igbn that's right so we would love to have you come and fellowship with us and speaking of fellowship not everything has to be all high and mighty and up in the sky but we're going to be having our first movie and game night this may friday may 27th from 7 p.m to 9 p.m. Doors will open at 6.30 for those of you who like to come a little early. Um, it's free for the event, but there is a little cost for concession, so bring a little small change for some drinks and some snacks and stuff like that. Um, what kind of games are we going to be having? Oh, my goodness. We're going to have um, uh, all types of uh, Monopoly, Scrabble, uh, game, uh, all kinds of games. <laughs> and for those of you who like Jenga... We have the big stack. <laughs> yeah, but like, like this high, okay? And then, of course, ping pong. We have some wonderful ping pong champions around here and some who are not champions, and I kind of follow mm-hmm. that, okay? We've got a lot of board games. We've got a lot of card games. We've got a ping pong table. I mean, there's a lot. Basketball. Yeah. Well, we have the basketball thing up. Mm-hmm. Well, we may or we may not, but it's here if you want it. <laughs> We'll see about that one. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. <laughs> but we've got a lot going on on that night, and we'll have a family-friendly movie. So come on out and just enjoy a, a free event where you can just fellowship with your family and your friends, and mm-hmm. um, we expect to see you here. Indeed. We're waiting to meet you. Amen? Amen. Amen. Well, We've also got some some new stuff that we've got on the table. We don't have dates for them yet, but we do want to give you a little teaser about what those things may be. Um, oh, but before we do that, let's not forget the telethon. Oh. <laughs> let's not forget the telethon, amen? Yes, yes. So that's going to be June 11th, this June 11th. Um, that starts at, uh, 10 a.m. to 10 10 p.m. It's 12 hour event. We have so many just wonderful preachers and ministers who are going to be a part of that, but it won't just be preaching. There is going to be praise and worship. There's going to be just, you know, dancers, mime. There's just going to be all Mm -hmm. sorts of stuff going on and all of it to the glory of God, all of it to minister to you. Yes. Amen. And our prayer warriors are going to be here. If you've got a prayer request, if you need a, uh, the anointing of God to break you through in your life, you don't want to miss that event. You don't want to miss the word. You don't want to miss the prayer. And call us with your praise reports. I'm telling you, the, the testimonies we have from the past, telethons, I mean, one particular, our very first one, an entire family, and an entire family and extended family, both the family, the mother, the father, the kids, and and then the grandparents on both sides got saved just from listening to the video being played out of someone's home. They weren't even the one who were watching the event. This was after the event was actually over and a friend of mine was playing it 
and he had his windows open and somebody happened to walk by and, and, and heard it and, and was arrested in their spirit. They knocked on his door, gave their life to Christ, and then they went home, showed their family, their husband, he got saved, the kids got ministered to, then they sent the video to the, the, uh, the wife's family and the husband's family, both grandparents got saved and oh, now really? actually i think i told you this maybe uh recently mm -hmm. but they actually felt the call of god to ministry and they have actually moved their entire family to israel <laughs> amen and that's just one testimony that's yes. just one testimony yes. this is the kind of stuff that happens healings deliverance life change you don't want to miss it you don't want to miss that event amen amen praise god well Nona, yeah. let's invite the Christian ministers who may want to be a part of IGBN I to tell us on and what else. That's wonderful. And so let me tell you, as, as we talked about what our vision and what our mission is and how we uh, want to uh, uh, fulfill that vision through different things. So we want to invite, if you are a pastor, if you are in fivefold, if you are in active ministry and you're preaching, we want uh, you to utilize iGospel Broadcasting Network. How do you do that? You can submit uh, your videos if you already have pre-recorded videos of, of sermons, or you can come to our facility in order to record those. Now, we do that for free. If, and, and we do have other services as well that uh, we can add to that. That is a low cost, all right? But the basic Getting your message out, we want to do that for free. Now, what we ask you to do is send all of your video. If you have that video, you need to send it to us because we do vet that. We do look at those videos to make sure that the word of God is going forth and it is a pure word of God. So uh, we want you to do that. We have to go through our, through our committee, through our process, but we want you to start that process by submitting your videos to us. If you don't have a video, then give us a call. Let me give you some information on where you would send that video to. We got it right here. Glory to God. We can submit that that, uh, or give us a call first at 314-499-6200, 314-499-6200, and you can go to our website, which is igbn.org, igbn.org, mm -hmm. and you will see the way to go ahead and send us your video, all right? And give us a call. Let us know you sent it. You know, let us know you're coming. How's that? Amen. All right? You know, it's like, you know, you, you want your folks, you don't, you don't mind folks dropping in, but you would like to know if they come. Yes, all right? yes. So, so just, RSVP. RSVP, all, that. all right? So we are really excited about that opportunity that the Lord has given to you through iGospel Broadcasting Network. Amen. And that message goes all around the world, all around the world. And I also want to invite you to remember that what we're doing here is for God. And because we're doing it for God, there is a blessing attached to those who respond and who are a help to God's word and God's house. Amen. 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 So I want to invite you to enter into that blessing by donation. And let me tell you how you can do that. The easiest way is to go to our website. That's www.igbn.org. And right on, the, right on the very first page, you can just click Donate here. And it will give you all the various different ways that you can donate. There's PayPal. There's Cash App. There's Venmo. I mean, there's just so many different ways that you can donate yes. today's. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I mean, there just really is. Mm -hmm. So you, we definitely want to do that. And don't forget... That this is a ministry mm -hmm. and we're growing we're very new but we are growing and you can help us do that so please like our youtube videos you know subscribe to our youtube channel go to our facebook and um uh like us there become our friend mm -hmm. <laughs> like our page and become our friend on our account okay and all of this will help us to grow tell your friends tell your family just become a part, become a part. For those of you who may actually live here in St. Louis 
and want to volunteer, we need volunteers. We are growing by such leaps oh and bounds that oh we my. can't even keep up with everything that needs to be done. We're such a small skeletal crew here, just four of us really on the regular, but during our events, we need so many more people. And so please, if you feel in your heart that God is saying, become a part, call us. Give us that number again, Nona. 314-499-6200. 314-499-6200. You want to close us out today, Nona? You know what? <coughs> I think you should. Okay, well, praise God. <laughs> <laughs> Last but not least, let's all remember those who are being affected by the Ukraine and everything that's going on there. And they're not the only ones who are experiencing war. They're not the only ones who are experiencing <coughs> poverty or dealing with refugee statuses. So keep that in mind as well. Um, Jesus said that there would be wars. There would be, you know, earthquakes. There would be all sorts of things happening. And that doesn't mean that he's coming back tomorrow but he may you know so those are signs of the time you know that doesn't mean to be afraid but it means hey keep your eyes open and alert be sober and vigilant as the bible mm -hmm. says mm -hmm. but let's keep them in prayer and keep also in prayer those who who are affected um family members who may not be there but they're afraid for those who are you know so let's keep those in prayer Indeed. as well amen Indeed. Well, God bless you. So grateful that we were having this opportunity to speak to you today, but God bless you, your household, and everything you put your hands to. Remember, till next time, keep to, the faith and to God, God be, be the, the glory. glory. Amen.